everybody, this is Magic Mitch here with FoodChallenges.com. Today I'm at Purdy's Stony Hill Hall in Stony Hill, Missouri, about to take on the Purdy Monster Burger Challenge. Now I've got half an hour to complete this entire meal, which the unique part about this challenge is inside the actual patty of burger is uh, it is stuffed with mushrooms, bacon, and cheese, I believe. All right, looking forward to this. Let's, let's get it down. Four, three, two, one. All right, let's get it going. What's up everybody, this is Magic Mitch here with FoodChallenges.com bringing you another food eating adventure. And just to give a brief recap of the battle at hand, this is the Purdy Monster Burger Challenge. Essentially 30 minutes to eat 5 pounds of food consisting of a 1 pound burger stuffed with mushrooms, bacon, and cheese with a decent amount of veggies and a stupid amount of fries. This was attempted the following day after beating the Chat Burger Challenge which I should have probably taken more into consideration before attempting the challenge, but since it was my last day in St. Louis, I decided to get a little greedy and I tried to snag another win before my trip ended. During this challenge, I quickly learned I don't particularly care for mushrooms in my food challenges, which is why you see me using other vegetables to change up the flavor. While I do enjoy eating mushrooms when I'm not doing food challenges, in this case I found myself suffering from flavor fatigue fairly quickly with them, which is why I was trying to incorporate the other vegetables with them to try to mask the flavor and the texture of the mushrooms. Looking back at this challenge, I should have had a little concern about my pace when I wasn't able to complete the entire burger patty under about 8 minutes because I knew I was going to be spending a majority of my time working on the enormous pile of fries. Now as you can probably see, I'm already starting to get the stage 1 meat sweats at this point. And also, I don't know why, but it seems like I was trying to stick with the water for as long as possible. And I just don't know why. I think it would have been smarter to switch up to the lemonade to help with the flavor of the patty, especially since I was taking so long to finish it. Now, as far as my review for this challenge, when it pertains to the food challenge structure, I give it about a 2.5 out of 5. I mean. 5 pounds of food in 30 minutes is a bump up in difficulty, especially with the amount of fries in the challenge, and even though it's closer to your typical burger challenge, I do appreciate the unique aspect of it having the ingredients stuffed into the burger patty itself. Now as far as the taste, I would give it about a 3 out of 5. Even though I'm not the biggest fan of mushrooms during my food challenges, everything tasted good, but essentially there wasn't anything really that stood out for me on this challenge, whether it was the burger or the fries but the vegetables used were fresh, which is always a plus. Now one final thing before I bring this video to a close, although I'm not going to give out any specific spoilers away, dark times are ahead. As I've talked about before, I try to make the most out of every food adventure, regardless of the outcome. So for future videos, I'll try to do my best to give a little insight if I learned anything from that food challenge, especially when I come up short. And of course, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a little magic of your own. Be sure to like, and share this video, and subscribe for more food eating adventures. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave them below. I greatly appreciate it. Until next time, this is Magic Mitch with FoodChallenges.com. Have a wonderful day. That's it.